Hey y'all, it's Alex and you are watching Peach Perfect. Thanks so much for tuning in. So today you are seeing one of the newest additions to my home gym. And my home gym actually means my bonus room with just like a couple of little things. So that's why I'm so excited about this because this is definitely going to be one of my staple items in my home gym that just keeps on growing. Um, so it is called a booty sprout. That's all I'm gonna give you right this second. I'm gonna do our little reminders and then I'll get into all the good stuff. So couple of reminders. One, if you are new to the channel, welcome. I am so happy to have you here. Definitely hit that subscribe button. I've got lots of awesome videos coming up here soon that you do not want to miss out on. Two, I do have an Amazon wish list. So if there is something in particular that you want to see me try on or review, you can definitely find lots of goodies on there. I've got lingerie, I've got bikinis, I've got clothing, I've got shoes, all sorts of stuff. And if you find something that you like on Amazon that you want me to review that is not on the list, just copy and paste the link, shoot it to me in an email, and I'd be happy to add it. And three, I do have a Patreon account, so if there is a more exclusive side to me that you would like to see, you can definitely check that out. I post weekly exclusive selfies and videos that you're not gonna find anywhere else other than my Patreon. So, on to the good stuff. So this item is called the Booty Sprout. I am so excited, so excited to be working with them. Um, I have been eyeing this bad boy for a couple of years, so I am so excited to finally have it in my home. So basically, it's if y'all have ever heard of hip thrusters at the gym, it's basically like a hip thruster machine. And hip thrusters are awesome at helping build the booty and like the hamstrings. So whenever I do hip thrusters at the gym, I either do them with like a barbell or um, the like the quad raises th that machine. I don't know the technical term. Um, I get under that so my back is like against the, the seat and I'm doing the hip thrusters on them. So being that I haven't been to the gym since March of 2020, just because of COVID stuff, um, I have been dying dying without my hip thrusters. Um, I mean, I have a couple of, you know, kettlebells and dumbbells that, I, that I've been doing, but nothing like this. So I am so pumped to have this. I am so pumped to be able to do hip thrusters again. I feel like I definitely lost a lot of my, not a lot, but a little of my booty during um, COVID and pregnancy and postpartum and all of that. So I definitely cannot wait to, to get those gains back. So a couple of things with this it's very easy to kind of fold up you kind of see this like little silver lever here all you have to do is just pull and it just folds right down and then as soon as you do it up it just clips right in same thing there's a little silver level lever on this all you have to do is pull that out this whole piece folds in so it's very 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 easy to fold up very portable um so you know if you want it if you want it in the bedroom, if you're if you do your workouts in the bedroom, then you can carry it up there. If you want to carry it out to the garage, it's easy and portable, and it's very easy to collapse. So that's always a good thing, especially with like gym equipment, because typically you can't really just like put it up. So that's awesome that this is like very easy to fold up. Um, you know, I typically just leave it out in the bonus room. My husband, if if any of y'all know us personally, you'll know that he's like the most anal. OCD person ever so every time I leave it out up here I come up and he's like folded it away neatly and so it's very easy to fold away so that is the main this is the main base obviously so it's got just like the metal substructure it's got like this little pillow here this is what your back is going to go against and then it's got this little like kind of wooden platform here then the other things that this includes are three stretchy like cable bands. They've all got two little little hooky things on either side and really heavy like reinforced like rubber and then these little like it's almost like something over the stretchy piece whatever that's called. I don't know what material it is. Um, and then it comes with like the little foam thing to kind of hook around it and so that you can kind of put it over your hips because if you have not done hip thrusters it was so funny 
since I haven't done them, like true hip thrusters on a machine in like over a year, I did it for the first time. I've been doing them like every day for like the past two weeks since I've gotten this. And I forgot how sore you get like right here, right on my hip bones, I get very, very tender. So it's awesome that they have this. And even with this, if you're doing all three bands, you'll probably still be a little tender. Just give it a couple days it'll get used to it and then it won't hurt anymore. It's not like painful, it's just you can definitely, it almost feels like it's slightly bruised there, just because it's a lot of weight. Now one thing that I do, just because I don't know about y'all, but I get super ridiculous sweaty, so I just grabbed a little like kitchen hand towel and I just throw it over here because I just, I know I sweat and then I stink when I'm sweaty, so I don't want this guy to just like get super nasty and gross and start smelling bad, so I've just put this here and like once a week I'll just wash that. Um, but so I'm going to show y'all how to use this. This is just so awesome. The one, the one thing that I wish was just slightly different and it's not a huge deal, but the one thing that I'm not a fan of that I wish was slightly different is that this is super slick. There's like little cuts in the wood to kind of make it grippy but depending on what shoes you're wearing, it's very, very slippery. So basically, I'm gonna kinda of show you without this stuff first. So basically you have your legs here, and what you're doing is, is you're coming up, the bands are right here, and you're coming up like this. So your feet are on that platform, but when you're pushing, I mean, you can see my feet just slip, slip and slide all over it. I don't have like a lot of super grippy shoes. So that's the one downside to this. And I've asked my husband, he's the engineer, so he can think of all of this stuff. I'm like, can you like epoxy or super glue something on this that kind of makes it like a little rougher so that my feet actually stick on it? Cause that's the one downside is that I've got my tennis shoes on when I'm typically working out and my feet are just slipping on it the whole time. So that is the one, the only negative to this piece of equipment that I have found so far. So, okay, I'm going to show y'all how to kind of get everything working. So basically, all you do is you just clip, and these, they're, they look like handles, but they're really for these pieces. So all you do, and actually, I'm going to lay this here, and I'll just show y'all with two. I haven't worked, I can do three, but not very well, because again, I've definitely lost some muscle. So you just clip on one side, clip on the other side, and then basically you just wrap this, there's a little Velcro, Velcro. And so all you're doing is you're kind of getting your feet ready and do not judge my mom pudge. Don't judge me. I'm eight months postpartum. I still haven't gotten rid of all of it yet. So basically what you're doing is you're in this position and you're just coming up and you're squeezing at the top. And again, I don't even feel like I can fully go down because my feet are sliding. So again, that's the only downside that I have found with this is that the, the wood platform is just super slick. Um, but I typically try to do like 100. I'll do like four, four sets of like 25 at a time. Um, and you can do it narrow stance. You can do it wide stance. You can do it heels in. So you're getting all different parts of the booty when you're doing all of that. Um, and you definitely, not only will you feel it in the booty, but you will absolutely feel it in your hamstrings. Like the next day I was going, God, did I do like deadlifts or something? And then I just forgot about them. <laughs> it was because of this. So not only does it work your booty, but it will get your hamstrings burning. So that is my new piece of equipment. Like I said, it's called Booty Sprout. I'll tag, I mean, I'll um, link their Instagram, I'll link their website. I'll link the product link itself so that it's very easy to find and very easy to get to. But I absolutely love this thing. Again, everything about it is absolutely awesome. This is the only downside that I've found. And I think it'll be an easy fix. He'll probably just, you know, kind of get something rough and kind of glue it on. But other than that, that is the only downside that I've found. It is so awesome to have. I highly recommend this for anybody, especially that are trying to get build their, their booty or their, their legs. But yeah, so I hope that that was helpful. I hope that y'all enjoyed. Please reach out to me if you've got any questions or concerns. Um, and as always, you can always find me on Instagram at Poodles, Planks, and Pumps. And yeah, like I said, I will link everything. 
Hope y'all are having a great weekend and I will see y'all soon. Mwah.